Good afternoon and welcome to the mountains. We're up here just outside of Central City. And little, Black Hawk. And Black Hawk and Black Hawk. And it's starting to rain a little bit. But it feels good. It's not 100 degrees up here. That is true. It is nice. It is nice. And we thought we'd uh, just hit a couple trails up here and see what's going on. And then uh, head back down to Central City and Black Hawk. Maybe do a little bit of gambling, check out the new casinos that are down there. We're not big gamblers, but we're here, so we might as well check it out. Might as well check it out. But uh, yeah, should be fun. Something a little different today. So up here in Central City, let's see how it goes.
Hello! We have come back from our jeeping trail extravaganza adventure. Yep. And that was fun, got caught in some rain. Uh, now we're here in Central City and we've stopped at the Teller House. And this is a, used to be a hotel, built in 1892. And uh, now it's actually a restaurant. But this is also the place where they have the bar with the, uh, the face on the floor that was painted on. So, um, pretty famous. <laughs> it is, and it kind of smells. It smells really It's kind of cool. I mean, you're in the old stuff. <laughs> yep. All right, we'll walk around and check it out. Right, we'll show you. All right. So this is your, kind of your, I'm assuming, lobby with some... Creepy, creepy old penny bank toys <laughs> from the olden days. <laughs> There's your lobby. There's a gift store. We'll go check that out in just a second. Let's go into the lobby-ish area. And I assume this would have been where people checked in originally. You have your stairs upstairs to the rooms. Your big clock with the big creepy head on it. So the story is, the city of Central City hired Davis to do some murals here in the city. And when he did them, he did more of like gunfighters and miners, since this was a mining city. And the city was not happy about that. They wanted more mountains and such. So they fired him. Or he quit, one of the two. And so on his way out, he was staying here at the Teller House. The night before he left, he got with the night clerk and said, I got a plan. And so overnight, he went down and he painted the, the face on the ballroom floor. Got it all done. And then from there, um, finished it and then left. And he never said anything, he just left before anybody saw it. And then the city decided to make it more mythic, I guess, and said, ooh, we don't know where this came from, and became more of a touristy thing like that. He says it's his wife, and it's based on that poem, oh, um, based on the barroom floor. But, so that's what it is. It's pretty cool. Small. All right, here is the little gift shop. Gives little gift shop. Ooh, I know where I'm going when I get me my hat for the next derby. Look at these. These are cool. Get your cowboy hands. That's cute. Hmm. Get a cape.
guys. Hello. We're back. And that's about it for our adventures today, I think. Yeah, we opted not to go gambling today. There's a lot of people up there. And since we're not big gamblers, it didn't really seem worth it. <laughs> so. No, not really. So we did. We went into Central City, walked around a little bit, and then went down to Blackhawk and walked around a little bit and said, nah, I don't <laughs> think so. So we're just, uh, so we did the uh, Yankee Hill Trail up above Central City. It would, uh, if we had taken it all the way, it would have taken us over to St. Mary's Glacier and then dropped us down into uh, Idaho Springs if we wanted to, but it was raining, so we turned around. And then obviously we stopped by Central City, looked at the Taylor House, and I think that was fine. I, th I really enjoyed that. Oh yeah, and we saw the really creepy cemetery. You'll see that. Too. Oh yes, and the cemetery. That's right. So ran through that while we were getting dodged by, or trying to dodge lightning bolts. Lightning <laughs> and rain, which is kind of creepy in <laughs> this old cemetery. So, uh, but yeah, I really, for it didn't go exactly as we planned, but I I really enjoyed it too. Yeah. I mean, I'm glad we were able to get up and head into the hills. I think we'll try to do that here again as it's warming up in the next couple months before we fall back into snow again here. Try to go a little bit further every time we go before yep. the snow comes. Yeah, yeah exactly, <laughs> exactly. So so uh, we'll we'll do some more jeeping and some more trails and I think that's that's a lot of fun. So it's pretty neat. So all right. All right, thanks for joining us and we're off to, to another, another Colorado, Colorado adventure. adventure. Bye. Hello, so we have a small coda to our video. We decided on the way home to stop at the Morrison Inn here in Morrison. Have a little dinner, maybe a little drink to drink. Yeah, let me show you our drinks. There we go. There we go. Chris got a pineapple. I got a raspberry margarita. So I got, got the big one. Got it. Gotta have a red, or gotta have a margarita when you're coming to the Morrison Inn. So yeah. So a good good way to end the day. So even though we didn't stop at the other places, this is a good place yeah. to stop. So it's kinda kinda cloudy out, but I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. So once we get our food we'll let you see what we got. Food. Scott got the chicken chimichanga. Yes, with a little salad and some chips. Yeah. I got the smothered green chili rayon with a little salad and some green fried meat. Yeah, we'll let you know how those are. All right, guys. So we finished our dinner. Yes, it was it pretty was, good. It was tasty. And chimichanga, it was tasty. I had the rayon, green chili rayon. That was really good too. Yep. Um. I thought we were done. Nope, we're not done. We're not done. You gotta always have dessert. And yeah, fried ice cream. That's what's good. Fried ice cream. Fried Look at that. Ice cream. Like yes, I will have ice. a bite of that and we'll let Scott eat the rest. Fried ice cream. That's a big fly. Wah! <laughs> Oogly! Uh. Not towards me. <laughs> okay.